Hey there, and welcome to another Sonic Quickie. Today we're going to go over Nutcracker Syndrome. So Nutcracker Syndrome is a vascular compression disorder. It results in the compression of the left renal vein as it courses in between the aorta and SMA. So here's your aorta, here's your SMA. If you have a very tight angle in there, the left renal vein goes through there and gets kind of compressed. And this can lead to renal venous hypertension. It can lead to hematuria, microscopic or microscopic and it can lead to renal vein thrombosis in some cases. There's a slight prevalence of females having it over males. Clinical presentation, left flank pain, so anywhere in this region here, pelvic pain, hematuria, microscopic or microscopic, and gonadal varices. In boys and men, you would see varicose seals. So there's two types. There's the retrocaval type. So in some people, their left renal vein goes posterior to the IVC, and that can cause compression. As you can see right here, here's your aorta, here's your vertebrae, Here's your aorta, here's your IVC, and that's the left renal vein going posterior to the aorta. Here it is again in coronal. There you can see your two renal arteries, and this would be the normal type. So you got your IVC here, left renal vein going in between the SMA, and this would be the gonadal vein or testicular vein, which in cases in compressions causes varicosity. All right, so here's a normal left renal vein coursing in between the aorta and SMA. You see the aorta here, SMA there, and you can see there's quite a distance between the two vessels and the left renal vein can course through there very cleanly without any compression. And now here's one with compression. You can see that the space between the aorta and SMA is much tighter. You can see the vein is smaller here and then it gets bigger as it goes towards or comes from the kidney. And here you can see it again. Aorta, right renal artery, IVC, SMA. All right, sonographically, in sagittal, you'll see a small angle from the SMA to the aorta. Normal angle is anywhere from 38 to 65 degrees. Here you can see on this one, uh, da, 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 da. on this one you can see the angle is 18.8 degrees. The left renal vein should be there. You can barely see it because it's compressed. All right, here's one I did in transverse, right below the epigastrium. You can see the aorta here. This is the right renal artery, left renal artery, SMA. So aorta, SMA, and look at how small the left renal vein looks there. And then you can see how it gets wider as it goes away from this section here. Sagittal, you can see that the aorta mesenteric angle is very tight. Uh, I, I don't have the measurement for this one, but qualitatively you can see that it's very close. Now this patient did have hematuria, so this would be a nutcracker syndrome. Now if the patient doesn't have any symptoms, it's just called nutcracker phenomenon. So that's just they have the anatomy, but they don't have any symptoms. So this patient did have hematuria. So in transverse again, IVC, collapsed left renal vein until it exits the aorta mesenteric E region here, aorta, SMA, and then the left renal vein. And that's with color Doppler. All right, so this next patient didn't have symptoms. So this would be a nutcracker phenomenon. You can see the aorta again, the SMA. You see the left renal vein looks pinched. I mean, there you can barely see it. And then you can see how it gets dilated again. This would be the splenic vein. This is pancreas. So here you have the IVC, pretty much collapsed left renal vein. And then it opens up and there's pretty dilated. So this would be a nutcracker phenomenon. That's the same video there. And then with all the labels, SMA, aorta, left renal vein, splenic vein, pancreas. So this is nutcracker phenomenon. So I hope you guys found this useful. I'm gonna make also a blog post. Uh, remember sonographictendencies.com. You can visit there anytime you want. I have a lot of posts there, pediatric, adult, OB, vascular. All right, so take care, stay tuned and bye.